A child first learns to crawl, and after some time, he walks. <laughs> Joint Base Lewis McCord's 3rd Striker Brigade, 2nd Infantry Division, spent weeks crawling their way through company-level full-spectrum operations training. Now the whole brigade is at Yakima Training Center, walking. For the last 10 years, we've been fighting what's called COIN or counterinsurgency. Um, what the Army used to be was kind of full spectrum operations where everything is in play, the enemy is, is generally in front of you. What we've learned now is that we're not going to go head to head against it, an army. We'll go against maybe a conventional force with some army, but there's also going to be insurgents and there's going to be criminal forces and there's going to be other things that are playing into that. So we're not throwing away the counterinsurgency, we're just now meshing counterinsurgency with it's called kind of a hybrid threat. And so it's a, a combination of all these different forces and we have to be able to react to fighting a tank or having tanks roll through our engagement area, which is what we're doing today. In August, the brigade will be in full sprint at the National Training Center in Fort Irwin, California. We're going to be executing the first full spectrum operation that NTC has, has held in uh, about nine years. Uh, we are going back there and we are going to face uh, basically the same capabilities that we have. So we need to relearn how to fight a near peer uh, hybrid threat uh, adversary. So it's going to be a great exercise. Reporting from Yakima Training Center, Washington, I'm Specialist Vanessa Davila.